Today is a big day for some 200 senior students of the Philippine Science High School main campus in Quezon City. But not for six male students after they were barred from attending their graduation rites after allegedly spreading lewd photos of their female classmates without their consent. Pisay Board of Trustees Chair and Science Secretary Fortunato de la Peña confirmed the board's resolution Wednesday, days after the Pisay community protested the graduation of the said students. The school management confirmed the resolution. The PSHS board decided not to allow the six students in the Philippine Science High School main campus involved in the controversy to march at the graduation. We have been vindicated. Um, we have gotten justice okay, for the wrongdoings that have been done to our kids. And I think for the Lord, we can get it. Mark, one of this year's graduates, shared how his friend, one of those involved in the incident, reacted after knowing the board's decision last night. Sinat ko yung isa sa kaibigan kong part, and ayun lang, malungkot na malungkot siya kasi, ayun nga, graduation namin, magkakaibigan kami, tapos hindi siya kasama. Pisay said three of the six students will still receive their diplomas and will be considered Pisay graduates. The remaining three, meanwhile, will be given certificates of completion. This after they complete the additional requirements that are part of the sanctions given to them. Communications under Secretary Lorraine Badoyo's daughter is one of this year's graduates says she is happy as the six students were barred from their graduation rights. But for Badoy, to consider three of the involved students as graduates is a different story. I don't think that's correct. A lot of us think why. A lot of us are quite unhappy with that. Yung silang may tatlo pang makakakuha ng diploma. No? Because I'm privy to the details. Eh. This, this boys really shared those photos. But Pisay said the decision was well thought out and was based on facts and evidences. Based on the cases presented, based on the evaluation of uh, evidences, based on on circumstance, kaya nagkaiba-iba. Hindi ako at liberty to discuss it with you today. In a statement, Vice President Lenny Robedo said, what happened in the school is everyone's concern, adding that any form of abuse against women is unacceptable. For now, the school has called on the public not to aggravate the issue. For News 5, JC Corsico, we are One News.